Hey everyone, Mr. Cheno here. Welcome to our third episode of LSPDFR. As you can see, we're pretty much just going to have a little general patrol around uh, the grapeseed area. We're going to run a little bit of traffic, maybe take a few calls if, if, if it's quiet on the road. We'll see what we get, see what we can get up to. We're using the charger today. Uh, lovely little model this again. Again, just standard livery for now. But we'll be changing that up very soon. It's actually the updated version, though, with slightly different lights. We've got, as you can see, we've got the yellow traffic lights in the rear screen uh, with the siren. So we'll see what we can get up to, and I'll see you on the first call or stop. Okay, this guy here is driving a little bit on the slow side. Any unit in the Sandy Shore area, license plate, a stolen vehicle, two, all, Robert, Young, three, six, five, Okay, we've got a suspended license. We've got a call for a, uh, a stolen vehicle as well, but we're going to deal with uh, the suspended license. Because not only are we nearer it, someone else can deal with the with the uh, stolen vehicle. I like to share my work around. Okay, come on, you dumbass! It's a quiet little turn off this, so it's not going to matter too much if we. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to go with that. It's got us off the road enough. Um, like, let's have a quick look at the computer, see what we've got. We have, oh, it would be a good idea to actually hit search. Um, Jim Doyle, valid registration, valid insurance, suspended license, no warrants. Alrighty, let's go and have a chat with Mr. Doyle. Hey there, um, Deputy Chen O. Um, just pulled you over. Uh, routine traffic stop. Um, you caught my attention. Um, could I have uh, your license registration, please? Okay, and it is Jim Doyle. Um, have you had anything to drink recently today? Am I being detained? Well, sir, it's a traffic stop, so I'm afraid a traffic stop is. You are detained during a traffic stop. Um, have you taken any drugs in the past few hours? No, why? Well, um, got anything illegal? You never know, some people follow my car. Okay, well, no no bother. It's not really why we're looking anyway. Do you know why you caught my attention? Are you being serious? It's the third time today. Somehow I doubt that. Um, okay, Mr. Doyle, first things first. I'm going to ask you to blow into this breathalyzer for me, just to check that you're telling me the truth today. That's just routine procedure. I'm not saying that you look like you've been drinking, and you've not, which is absolutely great. I'm going to level with you, Mr. Doyle. Uh, the reason that I pulled you over was because I ran your plate. You were driving really slow. You caught my attention, and when I ran your plate, your license came up as suspended. And when I um, looked on the computer to verify the information, it confirmed what um, came up. So, I'm sorry to say I'm going to have to ask you to step out of the vehicle. And Stop, I'm also afraid to say that I'm going to have to take you in for driving on a suspended license. You do not have to say anything. But anything you say may be used in court against you. So, anything on you that I need to worry about? Anything that... You shouldn't have on you. Um, a Guy Fox, a non mask, a length of rubber hosen, a bottle of cough syrup, a brown bag of stuff for money, and a free Ronnie Jasper flyer. Okay, well, look, there's nothing. nothing. nothing to concern ourselves with there, really. Maybe our colleagues would like to know why you've got a brown bag of stuff for money, but that's not really my concern, and it's not why I pulled you over. So I'm going to roll PT for you. A suspect placed under arrest. I'm going to check your vehicle to make sure that there's nothing that you shouldn't have in there. Hey there, hey there suspended license for you. 
I mean, he's been totally cooperative with us, so I don't have a problem with the guy apart from what he's done wrong. So there's no reason to make it any worse for him or. Okay, nothing there. We're going to get this out of here. Uh, vehicle manager, tow truck. We'll get this out of here. We'll clear this call. We'll be 10 8, and I'll see you on the next one. Okay, this guy just pulled right out in front of me, just as I was about to pull away. He doesn't have a helmet on, and he's speeding. So, for his own safety as well. Oh dear. Motorbike chases are never good. They never end with. They never end with the cyclist upright. They usually end with a body. And we're at very high rates of speed. Yeah, if you don't want to end up dead, stop the bike. Because you're very, very vulnerable on a bike. LFPD, stop your vehicle now, or you'll be executed. I do have um, pursuit attempts in, so hopefully you'll pull over. It doesn't look like he's going to though. I'm going to try and I think I'm going to bring in state because they might bring a bike unit in. Which is what we're needing. Not nope, they've brought in a they brought in someone from LSPD. No box them, box them, come on. Box them in. Oops. That'll do it. Come on, asshole, Police, off the bike. Stop whatever the hell you're doing. Don't run, that's okay. it. Stay there, stay where you are. Down on the ground. Cover me. I only wanted to chat with you, I didn't have a problem with you. Kill yourself. Okay, Cornelius Porter. Okay, Cornelius, um, anything on you I need to concern myself about? Anything that you need to be concerned about me finding? Okay, absolutely nothing. Right. Um, I'm going to check your name. I don't really want to have to type it in, but what can you do? I hope that's spelled right. And it was, thankfully. Cornelius Porter, I'm um, valid, no warrants. Right, okay. We're just going to get him out of here as quick as we possibly can. Try and get the scene open. We'll search his bike quickly. Roger. Uh, a baseball bat and a pouch of tobacco. I'm going to just run the plate on that, just to make sure that it is registered to him. Make sure it's not stolen. I'm not sure why you ran, apart from the helmet. I mean, it's a strange reason to run. It's a slap on the wrist more than anything. Elmo Green, that's interesting. So... The bike may indeed be stolen, which may explain it. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to impound it. No, I don't want to um, tow the police vehicle. I think we'll get on the bike, get it out of the way, then tow it. Get the box van over to take it away. Here it comes. We'll be clear of that call, 10 8, and available on the next call. I'll see you then. Okay, this guy here's wiggling all over the road. Yeah, he's all over the place. Uh, traffic's relatively quiet. He is maintaining the lane, so I'll just pull him over here. I'm um, not too bad to pull over. No 
So yeah, right, okay, so we've got Joe John Doe. That'll do. It's not too bad. Um John Doe. I will just check all that on the police computer. See what we've got. Um John Doe, valid registration, valid insurance, valid license, stop. So basically what we're looking at here is our Boggo standard DUI. We'll just wait for him to get past so he doesn't take my door off. Looks like uh, vehicle's occupied times one. Hey there, uh, Deputy Cento here. Uh, could I have your license and registration, yeah, please? And it is John Doe. Okay, John, um, any idea why I might have pulled you over? Mm, that's not the reason. Um, have you had anything to drink recently? You seem to be having trouble maintaining maintaining your direction of travel. And it is a traffic stop, so yes, you are being detained. Have you taken anything recently? Am I being detained? I've just answered that question. So could you please blow into this tube, please, for me? Just make sure you keep blowing. Fair and play. Keep blowing, 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 blowing. And I'm sorry to say that you've blown over the limit. So I'm going to have to ask you to step out of the vehicle. You little dick. Piece of and it's not letting me stop him, so I'm just going to have to. LSPD, don't make me shoot ya. Do it the old-fashioned way. Oh, and it's not letting me arrest him. Great. And it's not letting me arrest him. That's not good. Let's go. No, it's not letting me do anything with him. I'm mean, getting more and more of this recently. It's really starting to annoy me. I'm getting angry. No. Nope. nope. Nothing's nothing's working. Okay, well, looks like we're going to be 10-8 on this one. I don't think we can do anything with... no. Oh well, we'll be... I'll fix my game, we'll be 10-8 and available on the next call. Attention all units, we have okay, a homicide, homicide investigation. Mountain range. We flip around. Uh, I think we'll roll over there, code 2, two two high. Seven. Officers on scene. Respond code 2. I mean, because dead body is never ever good. But, if they're already dead, then, and officers are on scene, there's not really a lot we can do about their getting there super quick. What are we, what are we really responding to? Just overtake everyone. Just you know what? We're getting close to the scene now. Got a gap in traffic. Looks like we're going to have to close the road off, perhaps. I'll head out after this. There we go. Okay, well, first thing I'm going to say is scene management, and that is to stop, stop all traffic, get some statements. We don't want anyone contaminating the scene. We'll see what what the deal is here. We've got a lot of people around here. Um, I'm not sure how to make people talk on this one. Ah, T. I've seen the other guy around here selling drugs before. Okay, what other guy? I called the dick. I don't know. A fatal gunshot. 
coroner's stuck in traffic as usual. I'll examine the body. No, don't examine the body. It's not your job. That's a coroner's job. Okay. That's something new. I've got one word for you, pal. Lawyer. Okay. He's got me a little bit concerned. I ain't telling you shit, pig. Yeah, that's right, you take a picture of the body. Great. Okay. Okay, let's get some ID from these people. Um, Stop! Police! You first. Um, ask for ID. Mark Green. Okay. Let's see. Valid, no warrants. Um. Have you got anything on you that, that I need to concern myself about? A Proposition 208 brochure. Alright. How about you? Get ID please. I need to see who's on the scene. Mike Zitti. Alrighty. Mike Zitti. Uh, valid and no warrants. Okie doke. Um, have you have anything on you? Listen, gun ownership is a sign of retarded sexual development. Nothing of Look interest. Okay. How about you? Get plump. ID, please. Johnny Jet. Great name. Okay. Johnny Jet. He should be a pilot with a name like that. Valid and no warrants. Please, and anything on you either. Okay. Yeah. Nothing of interest. Right. Wow. No one's got anything to say. I don't think there's an awful lot we can do here. What we're going to do, though. I don't see anything in the ground. As we are going to search the body. Oh, and game crash again! LSPDFR has been an absolute nightmare today. That's my fifth game crash in recording. So. What I'm going to do is fix the game and I'll be right back. Let's get back to our investigation. Okay, what we're going to do... Police! Stop whatever the hell you're doing! ...is we're going to arrest him. We've already searched him, so... It's a different name, but we know that... I'm going to arrest you. We've already, again, we've already searched you both. We're going to call for transport, a multi-transport. Backup needed for a suspect placed under arrest in, uh, Santiansky mountain range. That's not what I was wanting to do, but... We're at the little coffee shop around the corner. Roger. It's not letting me take that. Take that away, but we have a wanted felon on the loose. Target is the roads will be Frank open. Seed. Units respond code two. Is this guy going to come through? Yeah, see, they're still reading it as the road shot. Copy that. We're moving right now. Hello. There we go. Fixed. We'll be tiny and available for our next call. I'll see you then. Actually, we've still got this guy here. I wonder if we can arrest him now. Dick, LSPD, don't make me.
me shoot ya! Oh, shit! Hey, we've arrested that guy from earlier. You're fucking up my vibe. Assistance needed for a suspect placed under arrest in uh great seed. Ocean one, we can get that. Roger. And I'll clear up that call as well from earlier. Don't be a dick, just get in the car. Just get some off the road. Okay, you can go. Turn. All right, no off way. you go. What? No. What you bump into me for? No. Let's oh shit, we're gonna miss my call Thank time! You. Thank you. Right, now we'll be 10-8 and available on our next call. Okay, this guy behind us here doesn't have a helmet on. So I'm just gonna let him go. And pull him over and just remind him I put a helmet on, basically. We'll just get him to move up over the brow of the hill. Um, what has happened? He's just... just there we go. Ah, that's not too bad actually. Just need him forward just a little bit, just so I can get room to pull in behind him. Okay. Very quick search of the vehicle database. Um, valid, expired insurance, which isn't good. You know, James. James Wee Muffler. Okay. Um, uninsured, as it stands. We'll just double check that through the radio. It's going to be dispatched. Can I get a plate on this, Sanchez, please? Wait. Six, two, Union, Ida, Tom, zero, nine, seven. James Weismuller. Okay, evaded police and uninsured. Hi there, sir. I'm pulling you over because I noticed you didn't have a helmet on. Um, could you please, uh, well, that doesn't give me an option now. He's got a hat on, but that's not a helmet. Um, do you know why I pulled you over? There is no one in front of you, sir. Um, have you had any drink recently? Am I being detained? Well, on a traffic stop, yes. Uh, have you taken any drugs recently? Yes. Yes, officer. Well, thank you for being honest about that. Um, I'm going to run this little test on you to see if you're being honest. And he has been taking cocaine. Okay. Um, could you please go into this tube as well, please? Is that working? There we go. And he's also been drinking as well. It's not good for you, James, I'm afraid. Stop, I'm sorry to say boys. you're under arrest for uh, DUI. You don't have to say anything, but anything you say may be used against you in court. Um, have you got anything on you I need to concern myself about, or you need to be concerned about me finding? A bottle of cough syrup and a Jeff Faviano t-shirt. Well, nothing nothing illegal there. Okay, um, we'll get you picked up. I mean, he's the RO of the bike, and so there's not a problem there. I'm just going to give it a quick look over as Victor 13 gets their cappuccino fix. They can't operate without their ca cappuccino fix. Another brown bag stuff money and a handgun. Okay, no big deal really. Uh, we'll get this towed away, and given all the game crashes we've had, I think that's probably going to do us for this episode. It's not been the most exciting. Uh, I've been totally limited by game crashes with every call out pretty much. I've had a game crash, um, stopping, you stopping suspects, you know, just random traffic stops. I'm having uh, game freezing, I'm having 
I'm having um, just random plugins just seemingly switch off. So it's not great, I'll try and fix that. As that looks good. And hopefully the next time we'll have a smoother run through it and a more legitimate episode. But anyway, thank you for stopping by and I hope you enjoyed it. Regardless, there'll be more LSPDFR coming out soon. And soon is when I shall see you. So see you next time. Thanks for watching and goodbye.